Habitat provides for each of us as individuals safe and affordable housing for those of us in need. There's no way on earth that we could have bought a home without Habitat. When we first moved in our trailer, very first, my husband, I asked my husband, what's this, what's this feeling I'm having? What is this feeling? And he said, it's your home. It's my first time having my own house. So it's pretty exciting for all of us. Being part of Habitat for Humanity, I've been given that opportunity to continue my service, which has improved a lot of my mental, physical, and uh, spiritual aspects of my life. Well, for years I was on television, and I had the opportunity to come on board with Habitat uh, a year ago, a little over a year ago. So what I saw firsthand was that with minimal investment, you can totally change somebody's life. Not just that person's life, but the succeeding generations. I was in a deployment with uh, Operation Enduring Freedom, which is uh, for Afghanistan. I was um, an explosive ordnance tech. My transitioning back into the United States was uh, very difficult at first. After you, you, you serve your country for so long, it becomes a part of you. And whenever you stop serving, even though you carry on your day-to-day -day life, um, there's still something inside of you that needs to serve, something that needs to give back. The reason why volunteering is important to me is I've been very blessed in my life. My wife was um, sick and she received a lung transplant. And that was because someone donated their organs to her. It was not only a second chance for her, but it was a second chance for me. And so I decided that what I would do is I'm gonna give back uh, the way I was given to for the community. The need is undeniable. 1.6 billion people live in poverty housing. And that's intolerable to me. And at some point in your life, it's just not about you anymore. It's about, you know, what can you do? And what can I do that makes a difference?